Let me tell you about the man I met when I was still young. Ten years ago, our country faced the greatest threat it had ever known. The FSA was attacked by the Imperials, a military group of fascists who respected nothing, not even the laws of life and death. A soldier was sent in and managed to stop them. He saved us all. He saved me. But people forget. At first, the public was grateful. Then they grew distrustful. Before long, they turned on people like him. Mechanically enhanced soldiers. Bionic commandos. They called them dangerous, crazy, not fully human. Bionics became a public menace. Eventually, the politicians pulled the plug. Bionic soldiers were purged, stripped of their bionic parts like they were machines. Some of them died, others ran. And the man that saved my life, he ended up on death row for the murders of men I had sent him to kill. Sentenced to death, and ready for the end. This is where our story begins. Spencer. Hundreds of thousands. Maybe millions. What's left of the city has been occupied. Infantry, air force. Nothing we've sent in has come back out. We need to get behind their lines and find out what's going on. I'm not a soldier of the FSA anymore. We believe the terrorists to be ex-Imperials and some of our own men. Rogue Bionics. You're the only one with experience tackling both. We're sending you into the city to scout the area and help us track down those responsible. Like hell you are. I'm just a man, Spencer. I can't give you the last five years back. But I can give you this. What the fuck does this have to do with Emily? I have information about her disappearance. I can help you find her. The clock is ticking on this Spencer. Are you in or out? We've still got one problem. That's been taken care of.
Launch Splitter 1 to base. Over. Roger, CS1. Permission to launch delivery. You are go for delivery, CS1. Rest of me land. Uh, Alrighty, <clears throat> this is Bionic Commando 2009. We're finally on the last part of the Bionic Commando trilogy. Holy shit, was that a long opening? <laughs> uh, putting this stuff together in the in, in the in the uh, editing process is going to be interesting to say the least. But as you can see, it's 3D. Holy shit, 3D Spencer without his arm. So what can we do? Well, we still have our gun. Which, by the way, I think I mentioned it in the uh, rearmed run. If you get, like, all of the 12 Yashishis yashi or whatever, or... No, uh, no, that was for something else in this game, which I will show off. Uh, there was one thing you could get in the Albatross stage of Bionic Commando rearmed, which will, gr which will grant you access to this gun. It's stronger than the one they normally give you, um, from what I understand. Uh, but anyway, I'm u actually... Most games I play, I usually use a controller. This one, I'm using a keyboard and mouse because it is just that much easier. Uh, I know, sorry for anybody who's dizzy. Um, this game also adds a new mechanic for this series. Jumping! <laughs> you can jump, holy shit. Uh, never thought you could jump in a Bionic Commando game. Alright. You can aim. Hey, buddy, how you doing? Hi. You gonna come? You gonna come? You gonna come here? You gonna come here? Ow. There you go. <laughs> yeah, uh, apology if his apologies for any sniffling or whatever. I'm getting over being sick still. Um, but you know, these have got to be done. <laughs> uh, cuz you know, schedules and shit. Um, but also I'm really anxious to do this for you guys. Um, what I picked up there are collectibles in every area. Anywhere from like 2 to 5 to 7 or 8, I think some of them have. I won't be collecting all of them. I, I Hi, how you doing? Okay. Nothing new. To Nothing new huh? Boom, headshot. By the way, this is about the only time in the game I'm going to be this accurate with my uh, with my gunplay. Just saying. <laughs> uh, but different things you could do, like you like you've seen me do. You know, I can aim, hold down a button, I can dodge. I probably won't use it very often until the final battles, unfortunately. Uh, uh, there's that. Hi! And, whoop, there we go. Hey, hey, come here. Die. Will you die already? There you go. How does it feel, guys? Still got it. Yeah, you do. Uh, we'll go this way. Whoop! I probably missed a collectible back up there. Another thing you've probably noticed, there is no life bar or anything. Uh, what this game does in terms of health is... Hi! Whoa. Whoa. What the hell? Yeah. My thoughts exactly, Spencer. But in terms of health, what this goes through... Do -do. I keep getting distracted. Okay. In terms of health, what it is is basically you take only so much damage before you die. Um, and the more damage you take, the redder your screen will get. You'll see that at least a couple of times. Nope. How about I just shoot you? There you go. Okay. Yeah, you're going to see me pick up a lot of these things. A lot of these wards and different things. <laughs> ah. There we go. Ah. Find your bionic arm. I, I like... Hi, how you doing down there? Got a little radar down there. Yeah, and one of the thing about this is they just straight ported it. 
And I guess they assume you're going to be keep using the Xbox controller because they don't have anything on, on screen for uh, keyboard controls. So, yeah. So we keep going. It's pretty linear, though. Uh, which I guess is one of the flaws of this game. You can't go back to other areas and like swing around, play around, or what have you. Yay. <laughs> and we are about to come up. Yep, here we go. Yes, I know it's unexpected. What the Hello. This is gonna hurt. That sounds painful. Okay, isn't me or or when Spencer looks like that, he just looks really, really odd. Emily? Your bionic arm can reach and attach to a surface if the attach reticle turns blue. Yeah. Jump and attach to the green. Yeah, for a keyboard and mouse, you don't obviously you don't use the left trigger or anything. If you're using keyboard and mouse, your right button, your right mouse button rather, is the one that you use for attaching. And you do that. Whee! I like how they in, I like how they do the tutorial as kind of a flashback back to Spencer's training days. And whoop, and uh, oop, sweet work. Yeah, sorry, Joe. Uh, and and kind of the way I did it there. Wee! This is always this is gonna be fun. Which again, I like this, and and one of the complaints I do I have heard that I do also kind of agree with, in terms of p complaints for this game. Like I mentioned earlier, it's pretty linear. You can't go back to other areas. Shit. Yeah. You can't go back to previously visited areas, unfortunately. Um, but, you know. You know, that's kind of a trade-off. Hello. Yeah, reel in, launch up. Jump up, and we. Good job, soldier. Good job, yeah. Stay clear of irradiated areas. If you get a radiation warning, get out of there on the double. Yep, also, and they show you. Also, remember that you can't attach to irradiated surfaces. Very important to remember. Green waypoints on the heads-up display show your current mission objective. Yeah, irradiated, irradiated areas are usually blue. I probably could have made that, but... Eh. Wee! Your iron boots aren't just for kicks. They also break falls that would otherwise be deadly. Well then, which means I like how they hand wave um, you being able to take height. Oh. Grapple any suitable surface if you keep holding down attach. Hey, get over there. <laughs> but yeah, I like how they hand wave how Spencer can take really long falls. Yeah. Relays are a key objective to complete some missions. <laughs> to hack them, you'll need to eliminate all enemies in the immediate vicinity. Yes. That that very important. This move you're gonna see me use a lot. The zip kick. Attach. Boom. Double jump. And boom. You're gonna be a lot of relays in this game. <laughs> uh then all you do. Do that. And you hit the B button if you're using the controller, or if you're doing the default keyboard controls, it's F. Yeah, sometimes it's a little rough. Um, with the tutorial here, you can you can actually get to know some of the more more uh, moves you can learn later. Uh, but right now, I'm actually just going to go ahead and continue on because we'll see them all, we'll see them all later anyway. Uh, 
Save complete. Outpost, do you read me? Go ahead, what's your status? We have hostiles within the perimeter. My status is now being crunched in the head. <laughs> That is awesome. Why can't we do that? I want to be able to do that. Because that would be so awesome. Pull an enemy closer, punch him away. That would be awesome. Oh, man. Oh, okay, so. So I, I admit, at first, I didn't think about where to go because I wasn't paying attention to my waypoint, so I went and explored all up in there my first time. But you're supposed to go out here. And this is going to be fun. Watch this. Yeah! And whoa! Let's do it. And immediately broken off. Damn. Ah. Oh well. But I have been able to make more fluid motions in my uh, in my training. Yeah, you know, I say training. Wee. Uh oh. I don't want to touch the ground yet. Here we go. Oh, there's a waypoint right in the t right in the t tunnel there. Kaboom. <laughs> oh, yes. Yeah, apologies that there's not a lot of talking so far. A lot of exposition that, that the game gives out that I want to make sure everybody can hear. Um, we're downtown Ascension City. That place has been nuked! Uh, because, well, we'll fi as we'll find out in story, a bunch of people are really pissed about this whole Bionic Purge thing, which we'll find out more later on. Uh oh. Joe, come in. I'm losing you. Yeah. Oh yeah, something else. I should have showed it off in the tutorial, but I show it off here. Is you can actually fire while you swing. But you couldn't do it. Yeah, shit indeed. Spencer's got a mouth on him. Yeah, and I'm just joking around here. Okay. I guess I have to walk up to the waypoint. Come on, where are you going? Oh, it's still that way. Ah! Damn. Okay. Yeah, remember he said you can't latch on to irradiated areas. Shit. I want to latch up there, come on. It's not irradiated up there. Oh, here we go. There we go. Oh no! That looks suspiciously like a pitfall. That I don't want to go down. Don't want to go down. Okay, come on. By the way, it, as well as irradiated areas, you can't stand in fire for too long, or around fire for too long. It will kill you. It will kill you fast. Nope! Oh, isn't that nice? Oh, those things hurt. Gotcha. Hey, how you doing? Damn straight. I admit, I like that move. <laughs> I like being able to just, like, kick enemies and throw enemies around instead of having to just shoot them. Or blow him up. Um. Uh oh. He, we had the same thought. <laughs> oh, looking at my time. All right, we're all right. Uh, we can't understand you, Joe. Which, by the way, for those who actually sat and watched the intros to my other ones, this is the. Oh. Hi. Relay station 21 has been activated in sector Echo Niner. Do we have a signal? Over. We get signal. Order received, HQ. Securing area. TF-16 out. Secure this, assholes. Citizen, surrender at once! I'm not a citizen. I'm the guy who's gonna kick your ass. <laughs> Boom! I'll send you the bill later. <laughs> I kind of like his one-liners. Hi. 
Identify yourself. Nathan Spencer. Codename Fuck You in the Head. Gotcha. Mm. And sometimes I like to kick and then start firing. You'll see plenty of it. And now <laughs> you can you can look up different things, though you don't really have to, they're optional. Um uh, head head up heads up to the downtown groups. Um Task Force 49 is not reported back. Um, yeah. Basically saying, yeah, the FSA might be trying to infiltrate us. Yeah, pretty much. Ah, oh, there we go. I hear you. Report, soldier. The city's deserted and flooded with radiation. You never mentioned that in the briefing. Remember that your bionics are extremely sensitive to radiation. Now get on with the mission and see what's out there. Yeah. My readings indicate that something is blocking your only way through. Is that, is that a monorail car? Monorail, monorail, monorail! And with that we learn RIP. Which, as you can see here, you rip things and they open up. Boom! Oh hey look, it's a nest of soldiers! Oh great, I ripped open a hornet's nest. Hooray! You know how this goes, Spencer. We're updating the navigation points on your heads-up display in real time. Following nav points will always keep you on the right track. Thank you, Joe. Yeah, in here doing the the zip zip kick. That's not going to be very nice. That's not going to be very conducive. So, not even for that. Okay, come on. We're having trouble tracking your position. The enemy jamming Ooh. signal is blocking the homing device we placed on you. See if you can find the relays emitting that signal and shut them off. Then we'll be able to triangulate your position. And why would I want you to do that? Good reason. Because we'll be able to resupply you through insertion pods of new weapons. I can live with that. Good. Uh. We got a fix on the closest relay. Follow the navigation point. Sweet! Don't get reckless. The enemy might be on you. <laughs> yeah, there's supposed to be some kind of story point here. I don't want to miss it. Um, yeah, again, apologies for the silence, but hey, there you go. Joe, I just saw something. I think it was the name of a terrorist organization. It said Bio Rain. Just as we expected. It's the Bio Rain Militia. I'll prepare a file on it. You'll have it shortly. And we should get that file if we don't already have it. But Yay! Bio Rain. That's who we're up against this time. Not the Imperials, it's the it's Bio Rain. Oh fun. Second relay, coming up. There it is. Hmm. Mines. Those mines must be controlled by a central network. Maybe you can shut them down by hacking the enemy's relays. Yep. Whee! Uh-oh. Little too soon. But that's okay. Spencer, listen up. Secretary of Defense Armstrong is calling the shots on this mission. If he contacts you, try to be polite, okay? Yeah, Armstrong. You remember the big military general guy from the NES game? That's most likely him. Yay! And I got a grenade. Grenades are fun! <laughs> You get to blow people up. And I'll demonstrate. Okay, and oh, hello. That's a fucking burak. How do you know I'm up here? Oh well, things like this. There, there's a few of these. Goodbye. Whee! 
Hey, Baldy! Ah! What the hell? Yeah, you can already see my screen started to turn a little red there. Oh! Oh! Come on! Yeah, there you go. Yeah, you notice how my screen turned red for just a little bit there. That's how you know you're starting to get a little bit beat up. It gets too red, it'll, you know, you'll die. Um, and you'll just have to restart from the last particular save point. Uh, the downtown situation. Perimeter has been infiltrated. Intel on the enemy is currently at a minimum. All hands are now considered to be on highest combat alert. All suspicious activities must be investigated, dealt with accordingly. Polycraft poop troop carriers are on standby and ready to move out to provide reinforcements. Polycraft are fun sometimes. Ah, uh, we'll meet them shortly. Oh, hey, look. AD5, floating lines. Minefield number A5. The yeah, yeah, you're deactivated. Great. Good job, Spencer. We only need one more relay, then we'll have your position. Sweet. Sweet, you can send me weapons and shit. Whoa. Servbot! Hello, Servbot! How you doing? Uh, you know this is a Capcom game. You know, this was from a time when they actually give a damn about Mega Man. Okay. <gasps> Another one! <laughs> I love doing that. That is so awesome. <laughs> that is great. That is so great. <laughs> Spencer, you've been without your arm for a long time. Bionic parts usually take some time to synchronize with the bearer. Your point being? My point being, don't expect to jump straight back into the old days. Certain moves and techniques will come back. Just give them some time. Yeah. That's basically another hand wave for why you only get certain moves at certain points. Because it's Spencer recalling them, as you've no, no doubt noticed. Boom! Hi, how you doing? Howdy, Nathan Spencer here. I'm here to administer, um, one humili- uh, let's see, uh, at least two or three humiliating defeats. Upon you, Bio Rain bastards here. Oops. Yeah, if I take too long, and I, if I grab them from the front and take too long, they could actually use their uh, shock sticks and and actually hurt me pretty badly. There we go. Yeah. Let's grab onto the right thing, please. Deactivating minefield. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. Rear defense. Attention pilots, during a recent live combat training session, bullet ricocheted and hit the rear venting outlet of a biomech. The result was a serious malfunction in the biomech suit's power source. Mechanic Yanero was up all night fixing it. The venting outlet is a sensitive spot on the biomech combat suit. Maybe the only one. All measures should be taken to protect it. Never turn your back towards incoming fire and cover each other. Gee, I wonder what their weak point is! <laughs> um... Let's see, so... Yeah, they're just talking about the thing there. There we go. We've acquired your position on radar. We'll update the mission parameters. In the meantime, proceed through the city. We need to know what they're up to. Yay! Swinging on mines! Swinging on the mines! Swinging, swing, swing, swinging on the mines! Whee! Oh! Yay! Who knows, at some point I'll make Spencer you know, yow with glee too. Ah, yes! Oh, lordy. <laughs> Alrighty. Here we go. Spencer, we loaded the first pod with a hiker. It's in the air now. Ooh. Not anymore. <laughs> All right, we have a hiker. This one's new. They call it a hiker. It packs a fierce punch with a good spread. Not exactly Ooh. subtle. Ooh, it's a big fucking gun. BFG, man. 
B F fucking G. Oh hey, can I drop this on somebody? Can I? Can I? Can I? Can I? Can I? Let me do it. Let me do it. Let me do it. <laughs> Whoa, that was explosive. Uh, I didn't get anybody though. That's okay. Hi. I have a hand cannon. What do you have? Oh yeah. Yep. Fuck you guys. I'm going in. Going in balls deep. Balls deep in enemy territory and I don't care. Oh, hi. Hi. Oh yeah? Gonna do that again? Mm-hmm. That's what I thought. How many grenades do I have? Two. Okay. Alrighty. Oh, hey. Oh, just conveniently, I learn how to do this. This is fun. That's another one of those fun things. <laughs> Death from above. Uh, if you're using the keyboard, the Y button corresponds to your E button in the default controls, by the way. You just hit it repeatedly, and here you go. Boom! In that shockwave. No, you wouldn't. This is Secretary Armstrong. Status report. I'm in the middle of something, Secretary. Maybe you could ask Joe. I outrank you both, Major. And don't you forget it. You report to me at my say-so. Fine. Here's the report. The city is in ruins. Everybody's dead. Everybody's dead, Dave. Is that what you were looking for? Oh, spare me the melodrama. I'll be checking in on you, Major. I run this mission. Not Joe. Well, you may be running it, but you're not about to do this. Uh, oh, uh-oh. There's one left. Where's he at? He's behind me. One thing enemies do can and will do sometimes if you let them, they may throw grenades at you. And grenades are just as fatal to you as they are to them. Which means... Uh, <laughs> it, it, Spencer go boom. Alright, let's see. What's this? The IHS. Um, okay. Who's your daddy? Okay, whatever. Crash site update. Man... Aircraft seems to be a manned FSA recon plane. However, if they were planning to land, they never did. The plane crashed into a building wall. We're trying to find a safe route up there, but it's going to take a while. Oh. Spencer, incoming paratroopers. Watch out. Oh, shit. Paratroopers coming. Better get back underground. Whee! Do I get to do the grenade again? I think I do. I think I do. The bomb went off? No. I was in a boo rack at the time. But I felt it. Here they come. Shh. Okay, here they come. Here they come. They're coming. They're coming. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, guys. Ah, shit. Missed one. You ruined my moment. Fuck you. Ruin my fun. You weren't where you're supposed to be. Hmm. That's what you get for ruining my fun, assholes. You get a shotgun to the face. Hi! How you doing? Hi! How you doing? Hi! How you doing? Hi! Oh, hey! Get back over here. Where are you at? Boom. Thank you. Alrighty. Sometimes the mines can be a little tricky. Uh oh, 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 get it! Yes! Whew. Look, it's a man swinging through the air! Oh, hi! Careful down there, Spencer. Those were developed while you were in the brig. They're called Biomechs. 
infantry suits. They're tough as nails and armed to the teeth. Oh. Well, that didn't work. Well, these guys are e relatively easy to take care of. Shield Biomex. They'll just leave themselves open. Uh oh. Yay! Uh oh. Oh yeah. Come here. Thank you. Oh shit. Oh, you want to join the party too? Hi! Alrighty then. Yeah, let's leave this party. You got I, I don't wanna, I don't, I didn't invite you guys. Alrighty. Actually, I should. Alright. Keeping an eye out there and make sure they don't, because this is coming up to a good ending point here. Oh, so that is this is the first part of Bionic Commander through 2009. Again, apologies for not too much talking on my part. A lot of exposition coming out through the game itself, um, so I don't have to explain as much. Um, <laughs> hopefully it'll be a little bit better on, on my end later on. Um, but I'm, I'm, I've been trying to work through different particular narrative points, and this actually is going to take us into the next major narrative point. So we're going to end it here. Um, thank you guys for watching, and uh, if you like this show, you want to help support the shows and everything, um, just head on over to patreon.com slash gomer21xx. Big thanks to all of my Patreons over there, and uh, as of this video, I now have a fifth one, uh, Tim Sheridan. Thank you very much for your patronage, dude. Uh, I hope you enjoy the stuff, and um, yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, so that's about it. Thank you guys for watching, and I will catch you next time. And until then, this is Gomer, the Ranting Thespian, signing off.